my name is Eddie Tofpik. I'm Head of Technical Analysis and Senior Markets Analyst at ADM Investor Services International Limited. And here is your daily technical analysis of Brent Crude Oil and Spot Gold. Ice Brent Crude Oil Futures. A reactionary bullish engulfing pattern yesterday with the market based on the combination of the recent 38.2% Fibonacci line at 82 even and nearby 61.8% Fibonacci line of the influential 2014 to 2016 move at 81.86. Prices rose back up through the slowly rising long moving average currently 82.5 highlighted in gold on my daily chart and closed over it. So far this week, even yesterday, the action has been a counter to last week's weekly key reversal up. Looking below the 61.8% Fibonacci line at 81.86, the next support, and is for the moment a dubious one, is the declining medium moving average highlighted in MOVA, my daily chart, currently at 81.10. And that's followed lower down by the rising short medium moving average, currently at 80.48, and the bright red lower channel line, currently at 79.36. And that's of the December 2023 to date bull channel. Now looking above, we next have the recent 50% Fibonacci line of the September to December 2023 move at 84.99. This resistance is notable as it has capped the market since late January. Now, overall, we have two patterns seemingly influencing this market. We still have the original early November 2023 to late January 2024 reverse head and shoulders pattern with the bright green neckline that's well below the market currently at 73.21. And we also have the newer mid-December 2023 to date bull channel highlighted in bright red on my daily chart, currently 79.36 to 88.55. The latter pattern seems to be in the ascendancy right now. So far today, a little lower, down to testing the long moving average in gold again and possibly being an immediate countering bearish harami right now. Spot gold, a sixth a sixth bullish white soldier yesterday. Most important of all, it was another new all time high and all new time high close. The market highlighted, or sorry, exploited the breakthrough higher over the combination of November 2023 to high at 2135, plus the extension of the upper trend line, currently 2141, that is highlighted in dark blue of the mid August to mid December 2023 ascending wedge pattern as well as the first 50% projected Fibonacci line I had drawn at 2141 also. And that's for the recent uh, December to mid-February, December last year to mid-February this year action. The question I posed yesterday is how should we regard the market in that should we look at the action since October last year as a potentially large double top or should we look at the action since about December last year to February this year as a halfway hesitation with the first uplift being from October to early December 2023, and the action this March being the second uplift. It is increasingly looking like the more daring second option of the bullish halfway hesitation is on the cards. This could give a potential move up to the 2265 area overhead, well up off, the, uh, off my daily chart. In the meantime, the next 100% projected Fibonacci line is at 21.93. The next 50% projected Fibonacci line is at 22.17. The nearest GAN number is at 21.60, and the nearest compound GAN number is at 21.87. So far today, a further move higher into new all-time high territory. Thank you for listening. This short version broadcast gives essential market patterns and consequences. Please be aware of the risk disclaimer posted both at the front and the back of this broadcast. Copyright is Eddie Tofpik and ADM Investor Service International Limited. And here comes the final important bit.